Namaste. Всем привет. Welcome to our indoor life channel. In today's video, we're gonna show you guys how we eat darbus. Arbus. Watermelon. Watermelon. All right, so who's gonna show first? Uh, of course, me. <laughs> okay, ladies first. All right, let's go. So in Russia, first of all, watermelon is amazing fruit and we all enjoy it. Um, and the time of the season is around August, end of August, beginning of September. We call so, it arbus. Can we call it arbus? Close to the arbus. Arbus, <laughs> arbusik. So, the way we eat it in Russia, we actually eat our arbus with watermelon with bread. And I know it looks very weird huh. and it sounds weird. Yeah, but bread. There is a it. reason why we do that. So back in the days, even when my grandma was growing up, there was scarcity of food. It was after war time. Mm -hmm. And um, if you eat just watermelon and it's pure water, and you don't yeah. like you feel full for a little bit but then like maybe like half an hour later you're already hungry okay. but when you add bread to that that adds obviously fills you much faster right. and then it stays because it is heavier much heavier so a mix of that becomes like a meal so that's wow. why even... that's pretty uh, yeah long inspiration right it's <laughs> the first time when i saw that why are you bringing bread? We're gonna have watermelon. Like, no, that's how we eat it in Russia. Yes, and I was yes. like, wow, why bread though? Like it's yeah, weird. But maybe not as much now, right? Okay, so, okay, but right. then that was like yeah, yeah, tradition okay. for even when I was a child. It's like you know, you get this nice fresh French <laughs> bread, you know, like which which like almost melts in your mouth. A little bit warm, the bread, like you know, if it's warm, it's even tastier and yeah, better. Right from the uh, yeah, and the you. Bakery. <laughs> Bite on watermelon. Piece of bread. Mmm. Wow. And then it becomes a meal. You don't need lunch after that. <laughs> gonna keep you full for uh, many hours for sure. Yeah, because the first time when I saw you like actually eating with bread, I was like, hmm? what kind of a combination is this? But yeah, I mean, once when you explained me the, uh, the whole background story, mm -hmm. then I was like, okay, <laughs> makes sense. Mm -hmm. you know? Yeah. And how, how is it eaten in India? Let's find out. Yeah, so in India it's pretty straightforward. Yeah, you know, you cut it into small pieces. This is a small piece? <laughs> this small is piece. like a brick, okay? Like, a, like a a having, small piece. Ha having like a small piece like this, guys. <laughs> this, this is a small, small piece, piece of watermelon. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's a small piece. So, yeah, and usually at, at home, um, you always put pepper a little bit. I always, you know? You know, get like some add up some spice, you know, gets spice me it into, up into the bit. shock state. <laughs> yeah, because yeah, it kind of changes the whole you know flavor, not completely, but it, it enhances it, 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 right? Changes the whole flavor <laughs> because no, watermelon is yeah. sweet. That's why I mean, we don't need really pepper, much, is like, like sweet. spice. Yeah, but the combination is I don't know how to explain, but it's amazing <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness guys yeah so how do we live together who knows <laughs> because i'm all loves mm. watermelon with pepper mm. and i have a bite with bread. pepper um, let me try it yeah try let me it try it and i'll tell you have a bite try it how do you like it <laughs> actually we cannot taste pepper in <laughs> <laughs> no it's um kind of spicy it's not very spicy, but it adds a little bit more flavor. Um, I mean, <laughs> I, I can't taste any pepper in it. I think because watermelon tastes itself it's strong, so yeah. strong and sweet, maybe a little bit, like it just 
like a cream sauce. I mean, I not try to put, bad. yeah, I don't put like too much pepper in it as well. Mm. So how about a little bit of salt just to make yeah. it all? Oh, yeah, yeah. I, apparently, yeah, like <laughs> salt also enhances the. Oil I was and, kidding. <laughs> yeah, no, no, it's good. It's good. It wow. adds salt as well. So yeah, it kind of enhances the taste. I know it's kind of weird for. You know, many people here especially, but... Let me bring all the spices, garam masala, yeah. uh, hot chili pepper, and uh, you know, cumin powder, <laughs> can make, yeah, can and make a little bit of turmeric on top of <laughs> yeah. that. We're gonna make a really nice, really nice indoor life watermelon. Yeah, indoor life watermelon. It's all spiced <laughs> up. It's gonna, be, it's gonna be a nice mix, guys. You're gonna love it. <laughs> I know. Yeah, so... But for mm. now, I will do it with my watermelon with bread yeah you can stick to that mm. it's fine and you stick to your pepper <laughs> yeah. salt but not only the spices of watermelon yep that's right <laughs> the funniest part we like to cut watermelon like in this pieces because mm. it's so much easier to eat it so when you bite a piece mm. like Otherwise, your full face, like yeah, you know, yeah, right. all the way to your ears, gonna be like all sweet and like all juicy right, right. in the watermelon. Oh. Yeah, I mean that. Uh, and this is such a smart idea to eat it. Yeah, I mean, yeah, I, I, I think probably many taste. people in India encourage like that as well. Oh, but yeah, I just. But Mama likes bricks. I cannot wait. I think yeah. So I just. He's like, like just I'm... take half a watermelon and. <laughs> yeah, it's one of my it. favorite fruits. So. Yeah. So guys, we're gonna see next. Amal is getting the smallest <laughs> piece of watermelon. Bite on it, bite on it. Yay! Mm -hmm. Nice. And this is how Toshi is gonna eat his watermelon. Our little Japanese boy, we're just gonna cut it into small pieces. And it's not because he won't be able to bite on it, just, you know, he's. Uh, He's a quite a character, so we want to make sure it's not all over our mm -hmm. house. And yeah, we like, have to remove the seeds as well for him. Yeah, so this one is doesn't have many seeds, so we're just gonna pick it out. There, he looks like he's already. He knows. He knows. Don't you wait? Your food is waiting for you. Okay, we're just gonna remove. But these are soft seeds, so I I don't worry much about them. So they're not the thick ones. And where's his little bowl? So we're just gonna make sure. This is like his lunch. You guys, check it out. Dosh his watermelon lunch. Doshi, wait. Doshi, wait. Your lunch is ready, but you have to wait. Sit down. Good boy. Wait. Wait, Toshi. Wait, Japanese boy. Go ahead. Yeah. Hey guys, I'm pretty sure you have your own way of enjoying watermelon, whether it's with pepper or salt, spicy, or with bread, or with bread. <laughs> whatever like you like, whatever like you that. like, yeah. as long as you like it. So and Toshi just likes it raw. <laughs> See how big oh. he has a huge capability oh. of you know eating it. So yeah. if you enjoy our video, please subscribe to our channel for more fun videos and fun stories of. Indian Russian lifestyle. As well as a little Japanese boy here, Toshiro. Yes. <laughs> he still wants his watermelon piece. <laughs> anyway, thanks for watching, guys. Until next time, Dos Vitos. Bye bye.